Do you know why I gave you detention today? I think so. Well, tell me. Because I asked you, in the middle of the class, to get rid of your scarf. You're a job. Why did you ask me that? I'm also not asking you to change your hair color. Because we are in Europe, and not in an Arabic, Islamic country. If you want to immigrate, then integrate. Well, that is what my father told me. I have lived here all my life. Don't you think I have the same rights as you? Freedom of expression, freedom of speech, freedom of religion. I really don't know anymore. I'm confused, you know. Why don't you know anymore? Well, we are supposed to be enemies. Why, why do you think that Lizzie? The news, the terrorists, everything. And when something bad happens, there are always Islamic people involved. So, you think all Islamic people are bad people? No, I don't. But it looks like we have to choose between two extreme sites. But it isn't that simple. The right unwelcome site and the left hippie welcome site. I do not want to choose between Trump from America or Merkel from Germany. There must be something more realistic in between. Yes, that is what they call a false dichotomy. Maybe we can start small, Lizzie. If people who cherish freedom, who know the importance of mutual respect, and are aware of the imperative necessity to establish a constructive and critical debate, if these people are not ready to speak out, to be more committed and visible, then we can expect sad, painful tomorrows. The choice is ours. So, when I spoke out about your scarf, you were not mad. No, I just wanted to know where that came from. I believe we should be able to talk about everything, even when we disagree, and even when it might hurt. Because, an open, constructive and critical debate is a sign of mutual respect, trying to get to know each other, even when we disagree. Yes, even when we disagree.